guys, it's your boy Bug here for another video for you guys. Today, we are doing forklift versus a Nissan Sentra tug of war. Guys, I'm just playing with you. Our forklift got stuck in this gravel slash pavement, whatever you want to call it. And so we are using one of our buddy's cars to pull it out since he was the closest one. Anyways, that's not what today's video is really on. Today's video is going to be about my truck and my brother's truck. Now, if you guys are new to the channel, make sure you hit that subscribe button. We're almost to 10,000 subscribers, so let's make that happen real quick. But if you guys have been following my channel for a while, um, you are pretty familiar with my 2005 Dodge Cummins sitting over there, looking all nice and pretty for everyone that drives by. And then we have my brother's 1995 12 valve Cummins that has been featured in a couple of my other videos. And today we're going to be doing like a, a little versus video with both of our trucks. So the verse video we are going to be doing today, like I mentioned, it's going to be my truck versus my brother's. And we're going to see whose truck launches better. Now my truck has compound turbos. I can build up a pretty good amount of boost before my tires want to start spinning. My brother's truck on the other hand, he's just running a big single. And so I got the idea of, you know what, let's, let's line them up like we're going to race. We're not really like racing though because we don't have a lot of room where we're going to be do this. I mean we could race if we were under the road and I wanted to risk getting in trouble but I'm not looking to do that today. So we're just going to launch back behind our shop. We have, you know, a good a good run up, uh, some distance, and we're just going to see whose truck launches better. I'm going to talk about both. So this is where we, we will be launching. Um, obviously his truck won't be sitting there. We're going to back up against that fence right there side by side and then we'll launch and we have all this distance to right there and then we'll have to come to a stop and really we'll just, we'll just see whose vehicle launches better out of my twin turbo Cummins or his Cummins with the big single turbo. And like I said, you know, this isn't some hardcore serious race. We're just curious on right off the bat whose truck will win. Um, I think my truck will. Um, comment below on who you guys think's truck will launch better. We have mine with the compound turbos, or we have my brother's with the big single, and I have a lot better tread on my tires, so I'm pretty sure I'm gonna win. But comment below and let me know what you guys think. Uh, would you just look at that nice, beautiful silver Dodge? Looking all good with them nice pointless mirrors flipped up for no reason. Gotta love it. You really gotta love that sound too of the old 5.9 roaring. Wow. Definitely have to turn that AC on. It's pretty hot one today. I think it's like 95, 97 in Utah today. All right, so I'm all lined up, sitting pretty over here. He's coming back over here now, and then we'll get things rolling. Hey guys, we have both trucks lined up, sitting pretty next to each other. And uh, they both look so good. I feel like just real quick, I gotta add like a little montage with music. I hope you enjoyed that this little montage with music. I figured I had to do it. Both trucks are sitting next to each other. They're both looking good. So yeah, I figured, why not? Anyways, now that that's over, we're gonna launch and see whose truck does better. Yeah. 
Okay guys, there is my little soot stain from my axle dump. And then my brother has one over there. Um, I got some bad news for you guys. Um, I don't know if you're ready for this. So my truck only did a one wheel pill all the way down. I wasn't even trying to spin tires or to do a burnout, but I'm gonna burn rubber. Both tires have to be spinning, and it only did one all the way down, like a one wheel pill. That's, that is embarrassing guys, like both, I'm speechless guys, I'm, I'm, I'm sorry, I'm sorry I let you guys down. Anyways, other than my truck only doing a little sissy one wheel pill, even though I wasn't going for any type of pill, um, it is what it is. Um, I probably, I know I can get her to fry both tires because I've done it before, but that time it just happened to only do one. So, you know, like I said, guys, I'm sorry. Anyways, there is the launch. I'm going to have to watch the video back to see who won. It seemed like it was pretty close and really I was spinning one tire the whole time so I don't know if that if that's fair because well guys I want you to comment below and let me know who you think won I mean even if it was my brother's 12 valve with only a single my truck still looks better so I mean who's the real winner I mean come on I'm just playing and like I said earlier in the video that was all for fun we were just curious um, it's the end of the day we're about ready to get off work and so we figured, you know, hell, why not? And, you know, that's that's what ended up happening. Truck, I am running a stock turbo over a 71 millimeter, where my brother is running a 63 or 64. I'm pretty sure it's a 63 millimeter, or I I don't know. It's an industrial injection fat shaft turbo, and um, that we were pretty neck to neck. We pretty much have the same injector size, but. Uh, other than that, I'd say it was pretty fun. I also forgot to mention that, honestly, I feel like I would have, if we had a longer, you know, launch pad distance, like an actual road or a track, I would have won in the longer run because of EGTs. My brother's truck with running that big single and bigger injectors, his EGTs go skyrocketing through the roof, where my truck, I have the compounds, it keeps my EGTs down quite a bit. So if we were to get up to speed a little more, you know, and get going, I do feel like I would have done better and had an advantage in the long run with the compounds. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. I know it was pretty random and it's not as long as some of my others, but you know, I figured I'd get some content out for you guys today. I mentioned in my last video that I was going to be giving people shout outs. So as what I said was everyone message me a picture of your vehicle. It can be a truck, a car, Whatever your vehicle is, message it to my Instagram, which I'll put right here, and I'll feature your vehicle on my YouTube channel. So I got hundreds and hundreds of people messaging me pictures of their vehicles, and so I'm going to be featuring, I was only gonna do one every video, but since this first one I had so many people, I'm gonna do like, I'm going, to, I'm going to pick five vehicles for this video that I'm going to feature. If you guys want your vehicles featured in uh, videos from here on out, make sure you go to my Instagram and send me a message of a picture of your vehicle for a chance to be featured in future vlogs. We'll be posting those five vehicles right here. Um, so those are the winners for this uh, video and again you guys if you want your vehicle featured make sure you go check out my Instagram at bug underscore BMX and just like that I will see you guys next time I want to say thank you so so much for all all the YouTube love all the nice comments the likes the subscriptions you guys are awesome I wouldn't be doing this if it wasn't for you um, like I mentioned we are at like 9,100 subs let's get to 10,000 real quick guys so make sure you guys are all hitting that subscribe button for me and if you guys are going to be subscribing to me right now make sure you subscribe to my brother's channel he was the one driving that 95 uh, blue 12 valve that you guys just seen what is your YouTube Hayden Manning just go search it out
up. Subscribe. Yeah, we'll be putting it right here like I do everything else. Got to plug, plug, plug. So everyone go subscribe to his channel. He's actually going to start doing vlogs like I'm doing, but with his truck, he has some other ideas. You guys will not want to miss it. So go hit his YouTube channel up. Again, just thank you so much for watching and everything. I will see you guys next time. Don't forget to like, subscribe, comment, and share. Peace. Thank you.